This is video 14.1. In it, we'll be looking at thermal expansion. The question. Suppose we increase the temperature of a cylindrical copper rod whose original length is one meter and the, whose original radius is five centimeters by 40 degrees Celsius. We'd like to know what is the change in length and the change in volume. First we'll find the change in length. We know the original length, the change in temperature, and I looked up the thermal linear expansion constant for copper. To find the change in length we just use this formula. We plug in the information from above and we find that the length increases by 6.8 times 10 to the negative 4 meters. Next we'll find the original volume of the copper. Once we know the original volume we can find the change in volume after the temperature is increased. We know the radius which I've converted here to meters and so the original volume of a cylinder is just pi r squared, which is the base, times the length. We can plug in everything that we know, and we find the original volume to be this. Now it's a simple matter to find the change in volume. We have the original volume, the change in temperature, and the volume thermal expansion constant for copper, which is different than the constant we use to find the linear expansion. Then we just use this formula, which is identical in form to the previous formula. We plug in what we know, and we find the change in volume due to the increase in temperature. That concludes video 14.1. Check out PhysicsX on the App Stores. This revolutionary physics app for smartphones and tablets contains over 100 videos and 500 multiple choice questions designed by education experts. It's been proven to improve scores for intro college physics, AP physics, MCAT physics, and more. Just look for the blue icon.